Speed to lead is the time between someone contacting your business and you contacting them back. A quick response time gives you the first mover advantage, reducing the chance they'll contact a competitor and will help you establish a positive first impression. Facebook ads are a really powerful tool that enable businesses to capture leads in several different ways. One method is to send leads to a landing page and let people book into an appointment, or another is to use a Facebook lead form to capture a name, email, and phone number. With advancements in generative AI technology, we can now generate quick human-like responses with realistic sounding voices that can be used over the phone. Here is a quick demo. Hello, this is Mary from Mary's Dental. How can I assist you today? Hey, I'd like to book in an appointment for tomorrow at 11 a.m. This'll just take a sec. Great news! Your appointment for tomorrow at 11 a.m. is booked. See you then. We combine this with the Facebook ads and automatically call any lead who submits their information and consents to receiving a call. We can book appointments like never before. This is super powerful as it reduces the amount of effort on the side of the lead. They don't have to choose a time to book on your website. Facebook will automatically fill out most of the fields on your ads form. So all the lead needs to do is click the submit button. Once they receive the call, it is far easier to communicate their needs verbally and find the right fit for them. We can then automatically book them into an appointment. My name is Brendan and I run Inflate AI where my team and I help businesses integrate the latest AI solutions. We've built AI voice solutions for several industries, including pressure washing, irrigation, real estate, HVAC, etc. I also use this exact same system within my own Facebook ads. In this video, I'll show you how to build and set up this system from scratch. To do this, I'll use Vapi for the AI voice caller and Make for the Facebook and booking automation. Don't worry if you're not technical, these platforms are both low slash no code platforms and are very easy to get started with. This right here is the Facebook ads manager. Now, obviously this isn't gonna be a Facebook ads tutorial, but this is my own Facebook ads manager. And I have used this exact same system within my own ads. So if you have already got Facebook ads running, then what you'll need to do is create a new ad set and select instant forms. So instant forms are the way that we can capture the name, the phone number, the email through a Facebook or Instagram ad. Rather than sending them directly to a website to then fill in the info, we can actually capture all of this within the application itself. And this is a really key component of the system because we're just trying to capture their phone number as quickly as possible so we can then call them up and book an appointment. So in your Facebook ads manager, go and create a new ad set. And what you'll need to do is go to this conversion section and click on instant forms. It'll sort of prompt you through the entire process of what you need to do. It's also very simple. You just click on instant forms and you create a new form. And that form will be set up for whatever your funnel is. Obviously not a Facebook ads tutorial, but all you need to do is set up the form enable capturing a phone number. And one thing that you will need to do is actually add a little bit of text on the instant form that says that you may receive a call uh, as a result of entering your information. And so by doing that, that person has now consented to receive a call and we are all in the green to go ahead and send them our call. So to set up our AI phone caller, this is a platform called vapi.ai. Now, if you do wanna learn more about the Vapi platform and about building AI voice callers, I do have a two hour tutorial, which you can go and view in the top right. But for the purpose of this video, I'm just gonna cover the very basics and then connecting this to our Facebook ads. So this right here is the main Vapi dashboard. You can go ahead and sign up using my link in the description. You'll then land on a page that looks just like this. And this right here is an assistant that I've gone ahead and created. To do the same, go and click create assistant and then just select blank template. Once you've done that, you'll need to customize this for your specific business. So adding in the system prompt, first message and all of the instructions to make it do exactly what you want it to do. And once again, I do have a whole variety of videos covering how to prompt your assistant, how to build these things and really create a powerful voice system. For the purpose of this automation, you can just go through and add a really basic prompt that just says, uh, you are an assistant for my company, do this and then just leave it as that. We're just gonna be setting up the automation. So once you've done that, just click on publish and make sure it's saved. And now we're gonna head into make.com to build the automation that then sends a call to each new Facebook lead. And so this is actually a really simple make automation that takes two modules in make that looks at the Facebook leads that are coming through and then triggers a call using the VAPI module. So once again, you can sign up for make using my link in the description. Once you've done that, go and create what's called a scenario and you'll land in a section that looks just like this. And what we can do is go down to this plus button at the bottom here and we can actually just search for Facebook. And what you'll see is there is a whole heap of uh, add-ons to connect to different platforms. And what we're using is the Facebook leads ad. And then I'm just using the new lead instant acid triggers when a new lead is created. And so what this means is that every time a new lead submits their information through our ad, 
this automation will trigger automatically. We don't have to run it at a certain time. This automation will only run when the lead comes through. Make sure to click on the module and actually log into your Facebook account. It will automatically see all of your ads manager profiles. Just select that and it will be ready to go. You will also have to select the Facebook ads form and you can do that. It will give you a drop down with all of your Facebook ads form. If you've got multiple, just select the right one and it will just trigger based on that. And then what we're using is the VAPI create an outbound phone call module. We can get this by going to the plus button once again and searching for VAPI using the VAPI verified module and then just selecting the create an outbound phone call. And once you've connected those two modules together, we just need to fill out some information on the VAPI outbound phone call module. So the first value that we need to get is the assistant ID. And we can get this by going to VAPI and then just looking at the top here and we'll see that there is an assistant ID that we can just directly copy and paste into the top here. The next field is the assistant. We don't need to put anything in this because this is for creating a brand new assistant within Make here, but we don't need to do that. The next field is the customer ID and we don't need to fill anything in there either. The next field is the customer phone number. So this is the phone number that we're sending the call to. So in this case, we're gonna click on the box here and we're just gonna find the phone number value that comes from the Facebook lead. And then we're just gonna drag it in there. Same with the customer name. It's just using the customer name that has come from Facebook. So this Facebook module will send us all of the information so we can use it on the VAPI module. And then lastly, we've got the phone number ID. To get the phone number ID, we have to go back to VAPI and then go to our platform and then go to phone numbers. And then you just need to make sure that you've gone ahead and set up a phone number here on VAPI. You can do that by either buying a number through VAPI for $2 a month, or you can go ahead and connect Twilio or Vonage through this. Once you've done that, you can see all of your numbers that have been imported on VAPI. And all we need to do is click up here. We can see this phone number ID, click copy, go back to our VAPI module and paste that at the bottom here. And so once you've done that for this make automation, you're actually completely done. It's a really simple setup where it just takes the new lead. It then sends this to a create an outbound phone call VAPI module, triggers this assistant to then call that phone number with the particular prompt that you've set it to do and you're done. Now, ideally you would connect this to an actual appointment booking function. So you can actually start to book appointments on the system and you can do that by using my Google Calendar VAPI integration. So you can get access to this template by signing up to my free school community, which is linked below. I've also got another video covering this entire template, which you can click in the top right. And so what you need to do is take that make template, go to your VAPI assistant and create a new function for a booking. In this case, I've already created that, but this booking function will essentially trigger this make automation to run. And it's going to be capturing the name and the date and time they'd like to book for. If you want to get a system like this built out for your business, you can go ahead and book a call with me using the link in the description. If you want to learn more about building AI voice callers, you can go ahead and watch my two hour tutorial where I cover everything there is to know about AI voice callers.